Hi, this is Jeff at Portworks, and I'm really excited to share with you an early access feature of our latest release, which we're calling Shared Volumes. Now, one of the big challenges around storage for containers is shared volume access. As you know, for containers, storage was not originally designed to be persistent, let alone shared. Today, you might be able to take advantage of NFS with containers to provide shared access, but then you're still looking at two problems. One is a single point of failure if your source NFS array or, or volume goes south. And two, NFS is inherently a, a scale-up solution. It's, it's not a scale-out solution. So to solve these problems, Portworx has introduced shared volumes, which allow for concurrent shared access to persistent scale-out storage from multiple containers, possibly running on multiple nodes. And then there's a little something else that's really cool, which I'll show. So here we're looking at three nodes, two of which are already part of a Portworx fabric that can all see the same storage, and one node which is outside the fabric, not even running Docker. So the first thing I'll do is use PXETL to create a shared volume that will be accessible from multiple containers. And to keep things simple, I'll just use BusyBox and mount the shared volume at slash data. To prove that it's truly shared, I'll start a BusyBox on a different node, mapping the same shared volume to slash data from a different container running on a completely different server. And here you can easily see that the same volume and file system is globally accessible from multiple containers. Okay, now here's where things get really exciting. I can go to a different node that's not even part of a Portworx cluster. And I can NFS mount the same Portworx shared volume and have concurrent access to the same file system. So now you can imagine some complex job processing using containers across lots of different servers, all dumping their results to a common file system that is globally accessible even outside a Portworx container cluster, maybe for post-process reporting or something, and using standard NFS. That's pretty exciting, isn't it? So to learn more, please visit our website at portworx.com or come try out our freely available developer release at github.com slash portworks slash pxdev. Thank you for watching.